Hey, welcome back to AJM Learn CSS Hacks. Today, I got a super simple one. So I wanted to show you guys how to change a little bit of the styling on the shopping cart page. It's super boring. I don't even know where the styles are pulled from. I think they're all like white or gray and have black text. So I want to show you how to change a few things. I'm just going to copy over all the code and show you what each thing does. So I'll pop that in. One thing to note, I put a note in the post, but with this specific code, for whatever reason, on the shopping cart page, you do have to save and refresh the page to see the changes take effect. So just know that it is working. You just have to refresh. So you'll see that all of it was applied. So let me show you what's happening here. So first, um, the body, this here, that changes the background. So I've chosen my like brand turquoise here. You can, of course, change the hex code. Um, body, that's your body copy here. So like I, I could change that to black. Title, if I want to change the title to black or whatever. I just want to show you some changes. Let me refresh. I'll let you see that take change and then I'll show you this next part. So you'll see the title and the body copy have changed to the color of selected. And then down here, this is really fun. I use this for um, a client specifically with digital downloads likes to put a little more information up here. So it typically just says shopping cart. What I've done, so this is telling it to hide the cart title. So it's going to hide what was normally there, which is shopping cart. This next part is telling it to display this new text. So you could put something in like, um, you know, things for if I could type shopping with AJM or that wouldn't really make sense since they're not done checking out, but you get the idea. If you wanted to give them some more information, you could do that here. So you can customize that text, um, which can be super useful. Like all CSS, you can get even more in depth with how you're editing this. Like I've chosen a font size here. You could of course, of course change the font family to a different font. You could change, you know, the boldness, if it's uppercase, the tech, all that stuff. So add any CSS you want to apply to this and it should work just fine. All right. Hope you enjoy.